What on earth was that? The sun exercise. The sun? <laughs> it's Japanese. I'll teach it to you sometime. It's not as easy as it looks. Uh... I hope it's made you fit. Fit? We're fitter than we've ever been. Yeah, but when are we going to know why? Tomorrow, at 5 a.m., you'll be at the George V docks with a car on the North Quay. A limousine will be there, driven by Charlie. You will wait for a person who will arrive by launch. He is traveling incognito with a bodyguard. He will transfer to the limousine. You will escort him to two addresses, then back to the dock where the launch will be waiting for him. That's it. That's it. If certain people hear of this man's visit to this country, or have already heard of it, there may be an attempt to assassinate him. May? This man must make those two rendezvous and get back to the launch. If you have any problems, you're freelancers. Neither I nor CI-5 exist. do that for? Your name is Sam Houseman. You work for Escorts Unlimited. You love your job. Dave Bentley. <laughs> Wait till you see us. And Mark Layton. We don't have to use these names, do we? No. Only if we taught you. Oh, well, that's all right. What is this job, this job I love? Well, this point here is C. And first we have to find A and then B. See? Ah, A, B, C. Where is he? We don't know yet. But you see, we're picking someone up who's going to tell us. He wouldn't happen to be coming by boat by any chance. He's wasted in this job. Oh, well, he hasn't discovered vodka, has he? <laughs> Look, this geezer we're picking up, who is he? We don't we know. We don't know. Are we clean? Are we clean? Yes, sir. Now, this is your direct on Scrambler, and this is your list. The Home Secretary is one, MI6 is six, MI4 is four, CI5 is five. All right, all right. I'll go and get some tea, sir. Coley. Yes? If the launch radio is directed to the ship almost immediately, there is no connection at all between the men who are escorting the visitor and Her Majesty's government. Yeah, this looks like it.
I like it. What do we call it? Our job. Tinkerbell. Roger. Okay, gentlemen, where to? 22 Alliston Avenue, NW8. Please. Got it? Yeah. You know the way? Yeah, I think so. You go first. We might change over later. Sure. Hey, who is that geezer? Peter Pan. Roger. <laughs> I was just about to lock it. Lock the windows as well. Wait a minute. Houseman, hold it. Why is the launch leaving? I don't know. Why shouldn't it be leaving? I don't know. Can we go now? Yes, but not too fast, please, David. OK, Osman, on you go. Ship reports message from Lorne. She has landed. That was fast. They're an efficient lot. You can say that again. When was the last time Cowley shook your hand? When I signed on. Yeah, me too. I have been meeting a lot of foreigners lately. They do it all the time, you know. You tell me more about that air hostess. Moron. Has it gone on? Yeah. I don't like this. I think we're better off in front. Okay. Houseman. Hello? We're coming up in front, OK? Roger. Everything OK? Yeah, it's fine. How about your passengers? Quiet as mice, not a squeak. And then? Look, I didn't tell her I was an airline pilot. I just said I was a pilot, which is true. I've got a pilot's license here. <laughs> I think we got company. Houseman? Yeah? What about the American car behind you? Hard to say. Around this next block. Stick with us, Houseman. Roger. Still there. Next turn should clinch it. Sticking close. All the way with LBJ. Pum, fiddly, um, pum, pum, pum. Uh, all right, main road again. Back to the route. What else? Houseman. Roger. Just take it nice and easy. That's the way I like it. Well? 
could send Charlie up in front. Yeah, but if they stay with him, things could get a bit warm on my side. And they might get between us. We'll slow down here, give him a chance to overtake. OK. Nah, he doesn't want to know. Hey, right. there's another one behind him. He doesn't want to know either. Do I take another detour? No, let's stick to the route. Hausman, we're sticking to the route. It's fine with me. them on my screen. There they are on mine. Is there any other way out of this area? Not by car. Hello, Leighton. Yeah. Tinkerbell's just been on to me. I think he's beginning to panic. What does he want? Keep screaming at me to go faster. Yeah, well, tell him we've got speed limits in this country. I already have. He doesn't seem to understand. Your problem. Thanks. We got two choices. Either we shake them off, or we don't. That's brilliant, though. What if we don't? They either make a move, or they don't. And if they don't, then they follow us all the way there, don't they? How should we reach the address? That's right. Well, we'll be like sitting ducks. So? OK. Let's go. Hang about. What? How did they get onto us in the first place? They weren't at the dock. Well, we didn't know our destination. So someone must have told them. Someone at the dock. Or someone on the launch. OK, Charlie. OK, gentlemen. Oh, 
Tudom. Those guys must have known the route in advance. They could have followed us from the dark. They didn't. You know they didn't. What if they had a series of lookouts? Well, if they knew he was coming off the launch, they could have nailed us at the dock. So what you're saying is it wasn't someone on the launch that tipped them off? Tinkerbell? Yeah, we've got a leak in here somewhere. Yeah? It's not raining again, is it? No. Heavy? Downpour. Take a look. They're going to block us off as soon as they see us coming. We've got all the time in the world. What about the back? I've checked. No way. Cowley. They seem to know about our visitor. CPI? Why should that matter? Don't we have a close security arrangement with them? Yes and no. And what about the ISS? So far, not a squeak. And the embassy? Nothing. Shukran. Chef Nazim. Afwan. He's ready to leave now. I have here the next address he has to be taken to. Yep. Excuse me. He's in a great hurry. You want him to get there alive? Or not? Well... We go. We give the orders round here, Tinkerbell. Just do as we say. Okay? Very good. Now listen carefully.
First rendezvous completed. Thank you. Share the joke, Tinkerbell. It worked. They lost us. It's not you two fairies I'm worried about. It's just my job. They're still with us. Nice chap, is he? Huh? Your friend, nice chap, is he? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hope he is. We're all risking our lives for him. <laughs> Leighton calling Bentley. Come in. Leighton calling Bentley. Come in. We're OK proceeding as planned. How are you? Hello, Leighton. This is Houseman. Can you hear me? Come in, Leighton. No joy. the brakes on the back and take it. All right, hang on. One down, one to go. Great. Coming off your side. for this salesman. It certainly gives you a good test drive. All right, I'll buy it! Calling Bentley, come in. Leighton calling Bentley. I don't know whether you can hear me or not, but I've reached the house. We're entering now. Okay. Yeah, I knew, Tinkerbell. Escorts Unlimited. Escorts Unlimited. This is Leighton calling Bentley. Come in. Leighton calling Bentley. Come in. Hey, Vody. Who, who was I meant to be, huh? S someone important. Was I... Your name is Charlie. You're not going to die. You're going to keep nice and still and keep breathing, OK? I'll have a man here in one minute. Uh, 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 
بدهاش تاخذ دواء دو يو مايند بليز مش لازم حد يعرف مسار عارفين مسار موجود هون ليسن يو تو اي بيت جيت ان نتمسك على الوضع فدان عليه تعمل ايه هنا اتاكد بيني سموت او صوبه في لوها هل تحب ان اترجم لازم تش... لازم تشوف شو وشو مسار شايفته مسار موجود هون وات از ذا بروبلم يو tell these two i want to check that room ah يجب ان يتاكد ان كل شيء على ما يرام شايف كل الموظفين عندهم تعليمات محدده تعليمات محدده عارف خلص بليز ثانك يو اوه تشيك ات اب ام اذنك يا مرحبا يا مرحبا اهلين شلك انت مش موفقه اه كلمه موفقه حاضر Yeah, well, I tell you, Tinkerbell, I don't like it. I don't like it one little bit. Look, tell Sinbad here he needs subtitles, will you? Mazakal? Let's do muta akda. Trust there in big white letters so that when you talk like that, we can read what you're saying. Mazakal? Where's this one lead? The kitchens. Giorgio himself. Those others don't look like CPI, they are more like SS. I must go higher. I must talk to you. And that room there is full of filing cabinets. You have to tell me. That is Dr. Hanish down there, isn't it? Who? If it is Hanish, they will stop at nothing to kill him. Well, who the hell are they? But then you can't be working for the British. I'm a male capitalist pig. Whoever you are, you are trying to save him. I just get paid cash on delivery. Why are there only two of you? Oh, ticket bell is worth ten men. If they find him, the British will do nothing to save him. The British must want him killed. I must help you to save him. البيت ده في حاجة ما زهدت لي تلفون انت بتسألنا انا بتسألها هي ما زهدت لي تلفون They got the area. They're 
Leighton calling Bentley, Leighton calling Bentley. Tinkerbell, Peter Pan, and Wendy. Having a great time. Tinkerbell? Wish you were here. Pardon? Tinkerbell, Tinkerbell, Tinkerbell. I know Tinkerbell is what I'm doing. Bodie, you can't go up there. It's off limits to everybody. It's all right. I don't exist. Don't worry, Jack. Just what the hell are you doing here? Look, I'm sorry, sir. They are going to storm the building. All right. Why are you here? Look, we need help out there. The man you are escorting is an enemy of Britain's allies. We can't be seen to be helping him against them. Then why are we helping him? We are not. You are. We don't exist, remember? Is Doyle in there? Yes. They're going to attack. Now. What are they saying? Don't go back to the Sell a Tinkerbell, and we are done for good. What's that name again? Layla. Layla. Well, listen very carefully, Layla. Yes? I think I'm in love. deal with the CPI. Now, look Why here. was I not informed? I'm sorry, George. I hadn't time to clear I'd it. rather have been up against BOSS, even the KGB. What the hell do you think my men are? Kamikaze pilots? George, I tried to hint to you that this might be a tough one. A tough one? If I lose those boys, there'll be an A1 inquiry. Uh, George, this thing was sent down from above. Do you think they're going to recriminate themselves? Have a drink. Hello, Leighton. This is Bentley. I'm right with you. We found us.
We're going to try and make it to the canal. We'll have to go over the roof. There's a high wall just next to the bridge. What the bloody hell do you think you're doing? I'll tell you in a minute, where's the key? What the hell? The key! What are you? I'm nothing. I don't exist. Blue, your Is this as fast as this thing will go? Who are you? Well, if I had a bugle, I'd be the 7th Cavalry, wouldn't I? Clayton to Bentley. Once we reach that roof, we can't hold them. Yeah, Roger. Can you see the girl waving? Yeah, I can see her. He's coming! All right, go, go. Move, move! Go on, get up, get up! Get up! Move it! Get up! Hold on tight. Does it matter now that we found out what we want? They got Tinkerbell. Dead. I don't know, we didn't even have time to clap our hands. I believed in him. Yeah, me too. What happened to Charlie? Ah, case of mistaken identity. The Sheikh of Bethnal Green's now a watering can. Heard that. That left lung. Uh, ah, you know, Charlie, he'll be all right. Yeah. Anyway, we're not out of trouble. This is not Hanish. Who the hell's Hanish? This is some kind of trick. What's she talking about? I don't know. Who the hell is she, anyway? You're talking about the woman I love. And who the hell are all of you? Oh, I know where they come again. All right, everyone inside.
Ramos. <laughs> Giorgio himself. And Silvana. <laughs> Marvelous. Complete success. I have to congratulate you. Thank you. Even at the price of a few good men, this operation will save many, many lives in our country. Here, look at this. Come on, let's see them again. Hell Anta KGB. MCBI. Lehman Tahman. Mestold. Marble Shaulik. You all right? It's nothing. But he, he is an impostor. What's she saying? The whole thing is some kind of trick. Maybe it is you two they are trying to kill. Don't you know what is your assignment? Or are you just a couple of dumb bodyguards? She's nagging us. She's just stopped a bullet. You're being used, both of you. Maybe she's right. Yeah. We got our assignment, and all along somebody's been tipping them off. Yeah. Why did Caldy shake our hands? We're expendable. Mm -hmm. Caldy? Why? Well, we'll finish our assignment. We'll deliver the man. And we'll find out. Right. Cowley, let me know as soon as you have the launch. What about the damage to my boat? You'll be compensated. Who is going to compensate me? Me. Come on! What's your number? 485. And what's your name? I'll tell you when you call. Well, who am I going to ask for? Philippa! Philippa? Escorts 1 and 2, calling Big Daddy, over. 
Big Daddy here. Where are you calling from? Oh, I'm glad you could join us. I can't tell you where we're calling from. We don't exist, remember? We've got our potato here. We're bringing it back over. Now, listen to me. No. Will you listen to me? It's been burning our fingers, and we're going to put it back right back where we found it. And if that bucket isn't there in 20 minutes, we're going to throw him in the water. Now, make sure the bucket's got its engine running when we get there. How is Charlie? Do you speak English? Of course. Why didn't you do so before? They have just made contact with their base. How do you say the bubble is broken? You made more sense in Sanskrit. I am an agent, like yourselves. That's why I care about Charlie. He is one of us. Charlie will be all right. Sorry about taking about. His name is Anwar Hamdan. He was my brother-in-law. He died for what he believed in. Oh, that should be fine now. Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Uh... Yes, he was a fake. We knew he was a fake. We set up the whole operation. Now, thanks to you two, we've been able to identify some of the key agents of a certain nation. Oh. When the real Dr. Hanish does visit this country, and that's a diplomatic matter, which is none of your business or of mine, we'll be able to guarantee his safety and that of others who represent him. May I point out one thing, sir? And what's that? Well, this whole scheme could have had another purpose to make them think that Hainish was visiting this country when really he had no intention. Very shrewd of you, Doyle. Uh, speculation above and beyond the call of duty. Which means that anybody else who found out about the charade would be a possible weakness. But who has, apart from yourselves? That's the lady, Leela. Uh... So, uh, with your authority, sir, I thought I might just hang about and interrogate her. Over dinner. Hey, now, wait a minute. Huh? I saved her life. And yours. Well, then you can't interrogate. You're emotionally involved. <laughs> Philippa. 485... 485... 